In your opinion, should the public be able to listen to police radio traffic, or should it be encrypted? I think it's fine for them to be able to listen to the police radio traffic. I don't... I don't see why that'd be an issue. Yeah, I, I say let them listen. You know what you did just remind me of with that? You must have just watched The Incredibles or something, but you reminded me. Florida is about to pass that law, it sounds like, where it bans people under 15 from accessing social media. Looks like they actually went through with it. Oh, 16, not 15. And thanks, Enzo. Yeah, there'll be more coming for that. I'm shocked they actually got passed. I don't know how they're enforcing it, though. Let me read. Because that's a very hard thing to enforce. Usually that'd be like giving your ID over to the state or something. Like verifying your ID to access shit. Like I think that's what they did in Louisiana, right? When they banned Pornhub. You need like a government ID. If DeSantis doesn't veto the bill, faces significant obstacles in the courts. Okay, so it's not like fully done yet or anything. The bill bans kids from creating or having accounts on social media sites that have any addicting features, which is super vague. Because everything can be addicting. Literally everything. Under the bill, those features include infinite scrolling, push notifications and alerts, auto-playing video, live streaming, and displaying personal metrics such as likes or views. Which is every website on the planet, really. Even Roblox has that. Not all social media companies use those features and therefore wouldn't be affected by the bill. Like what? What doesn't use the fe those features? No, I, I, I'm not memeing. I can't think of a single site that doesn't use some of some of those features or is it using all of them no it says any so i can't think of any site that doesn't use these in some capacity even youtube does that even youtube does that like i said even roblox does that roblox has metrics like that like i said when we first went over this i think this bill is born from good intentions as i've said there's no merit to having children on like twitter and all that like, that's just going to serve to be an absolute fucking disaster, and has clearly been a disaster. But I, I don't know if necessarily requiring government ID to be tossed over is the right solution. I don't like that. That's extremely intrusive. But I think it's born from good intentions. But I don't know how you enforce it. And this is also a little too vague with the addicting features, because that's pretty much encompassing every website. The bill is to stop children from watching Jack Doherty. Oh, interestingly enough, this wouldn't affect live stream. Oh, wait, it even says live streaming explicitly. Never mind. <laughs> I forgot that one was there. I, I was remembering the auto-playing and the metrics. Have you seen the McDonald's anime rebranding? No, I've seen a couple people in chat mention it, but I don't know anything about it. Oh yeah, here. it even mentions it here. Federal judges have ruled multiple times that requiring people to submit personal information such as age verification, this is meaning like submitting your government ID, to access the internet is unconstitutional. And I agree. I think that's just too intrusive. I think that's too much. And I don't know how else you're supposed to enforce that kind of thing anyway. Like I said, Bill born from probably good intentions of keeping kids off of things like Twitter and away from like weirdos and shit like that, but there's just no way. Why do you say MMOs are dead? Not dead per se, but most major companies won't make an MMO because it's way too expensive to develop too many resources too many resources, and too much upkeep. And pretty much all MMOs fail pretty quickly. Thanks for sub casually raining. Like, what was the, uh, the Amazon one? Everyone played for, like, two months. New World, I think. They passed a bill that does this for corn in my state. They have it set up so that if you see your IP address in the state, it won't let you sign in unless you provide those. This is going to increase the use of VPNs. Yeah, Louisiana, that's what we mentioned. Louisiana, you need your government ID to access porn unless you use a VPN. I think it's Louisiana, at least. Parents should just parent. Yeah, those days are behind us now, though. Just let the internet raise your kids is kind of the main thing. Give them an iPad, call it a day, shit sucks. You have been on a beach date. Was that a question or a statement? Well, I think that, actually, you know what? The very first date I ever took someone on was a date to the beach. I had met this girl at a house party. And then, like, the following day, I invited her to the beach. Worst possible date idea ever. It was terrible. Like, you just sit out there and tan and like small talk with nothing really to do and then eventually i was like 
do you want to go hang out with my friends who also just happened to be at the beach that day? And she was like, sure. So we did. And there was just a group sitting there and tanning and listening to music. Pretty much anything else would have been better. He's a membership time thief. This is a boring date. I'm also just not a big beach guy. I just feel like it's always so underwhelming. Like an official Yu-Gi-Oh! VR? Looks like it. Where's the trailer? This was the anime thing we watched. When they announced their studio. I just want to see what it looks like. I mean, it's a novel idea. I'm surprised it's taken this long. A Yu-Gi-Oh! VR game just makes so much sense. I don't know how much work they're going to put into it, but... You see, it came out that Jokic is a huge League of Legends fan, plays Alawi and Urgot. He even wears merch from League YouTuber named Solo Renekton Only. That's adorable. Solo Renekton Only is a channel I haven't heard of in a while. Do they still post? He does. He's still very active, too. You know who else is like a super big gamer? Is Luca. Luca's an Overwatch Grandmaster. I think he's also a Moxie fan. Luca plays with Mike on and brags it's hilarious. That's so good. <laughs> That's so cool. So many athletes that stream now. Yeah, I talked about this before too. What's crazy to me is like, when you ask a normal person like a famous celebrity, a lot of times they'll default to like a sports superstar. And you think like sports is like this upper echelon of celebrity and that it translates to like every avenue, but it really doesn't. There's a lot of NFL players and former NFL players, like really big ones that are active streamers on Twitch and I'll tune in from time to time and they have like 13 viewers and they stream daily. And I'm always shocked to see that. Like it doesn't like it just all it doesn't always transfer over. <laughs> but I think they do it just because they love it, which is the most important part. I hope you feel better soon, Wax. And yeah, I've seen some. I'm very familiar with that channel. Your fear of flying has really been vindicated lately. Hey, I've been saying it for years. Planes are fucking exploding right now. There's like a new a new aviation disaster every day. Not necessarily like full-blown catastrophe plane crashes, but just these tiny things that just keep happening. I'm telling you, it's scary. Chat GBT taking over aircraft controls. Oh. The Peacemaker trailer for Mortal Kombat looks good. Came out earlier today. Let me take a peek. This is no time to smile. Hell yeah it is. Fight a fire god is coming off my bucket list. I'm assuming John Cena impersonator. It sounded a little off. Pretty close though. Is it actually John Cena? He's used some PCC. Suck on that. It's actually him? Oh, okay. Maybe he's just not a great voice actor. That's cool though that he agreed to it. Yeah, I know Homelander's not Anthony Starr. That's why I kind of thought this wasn't Peacemaker. Or John Cena. You're the first bangable monster chick I've met. You think me a monster? I mean, it's cute. Shits take more effort than beating you will. I will so enjoy killing you. Thanks for the membership, Tyson. Nice, Tyson. So, I mean, that's pretty cool. Finish him. Go time. Oh. 
Activate Sonic Boom. Not bad. Peace unlocked. Fatality. Yeah, I mean, not bad. Maker wins. Waste of a cameo slot.